All right. For the stream, everybody. I am going to be streaming a game that I've wanted to play slash stream for quite a while now. And I'm kind of excited since I do like the genre of on-rail shooters. So here we go. Game or a 2000. And uh, hold on. Let me kill the music here. And I'm going to swap over to the console and uh, turn it on. And we start and we will uh, we'll watch this beautiful intro together. It is wonderfully made, let me tell you. So be right back. Ah, uh, love that sound. Way more into the PlayStation 1 recently. Ever since I got my component cable hookup for it, like the quality is the jump from S video to component on the PS1 is actually pretty massive. So either it has really, really good component out or has really shitty S video. Oh, hey, Retro Game Center. Thanks, buddy. Thanks for the host. I need to fix that. It says my singing has rallied them. One of the greatest things about Lost Eden. I should replay that game. Here we go. Now this game is entire is a Japanese title. Hey, thanks for the cheer too. That's kind of a weird alert for that. That's not supposed to happen. But whatever. Thank you. Fresh. Oh, what's that? Rocks come flying out of it. That's what happens when uh, buildings explode, you know, when you gotta demolish them. Gamera 2000. Now, I know almost absolutely nothing about Gamora, so this will be a little interesting. I won't have too many trivia tidbits. She's kind of cute. That was a really long, awkward handshake. What can you tell me about these fighters? According to the data, the fighters seem to consist of cells that contain genes. Very it's a burst. Gauss DNA. When the scene's over, I'll talk a little more. So, according to CDC, Gamma is at 30,000 feet and past noon in 10 minutes. We made contact with COC. Gamma is heading south at 30,000 feet and will reach the metropolitan area in 10 minutes. The situation tells us that Gamera is chasing after the fighters that attacked the headquarters last night. They have Gauss DNA. Lieutenant Morton, you and Dr. Mukanoki take the Harrier. Follow Gamera and recapture Gauss DNA. So, I don't know who Gao is Dismissed. and yes, why they need his DNA or to capture his DNA. But anyway, that's kind of the story so far, it looks like. Uh, yeah, we're going to be in a plane blowing stuff up and we're going to have our wingman be Gamera himself. Um, as I was saying earlier, I actually don't have a whole lot of an idea of what Gamera is, like how it is in relation to like Godzilla and the other big monsters of the era and uh, whatnot. So this will actually be kind of a learning experience for me. But anyway, hey, Burstero, welcome, uh, Burstero, welcome, thank you, and the FMV, yeah, it's pretty godlike. Um, one oddity with this game is it's actually one of the few PS1 games that is 480i. So, yeah, I actually have to de-interlace this guy, so it still looks good, but it's just kind of, it's kind of weird. Uh, not common on the PS1 that I found anyway, at least the games I played. Hey, Kilmer, welcome, dude. When am I going to get a webcam? Um, might get one soon. Uh, not really too certain on that. Uh, 
I kind of got to have a really good setup for it, or I want to, like, I got a good idea, but we'll, we'll see, we'll see. Anyway, I might swap back over to this little setup here. I think this would be a little bit better for this. But anyway, let's, uh, let's kind of get into the game here. Oh, thanks again for the bits, dude. I appreciate that. Uh, I am curious why my alerts didn't work correctly for bits. They do for follows, but for bits, let me, uh... Okay, bro. <laughs> I just made a pun! A pun! <gasps> oh, wait. Okay, so, weird. So that was my test alert for bits, and it seems to be coming through, but for whatever reason, uh, it wasn't working when you did it. But I appreciate it. Thank you. I'll have to troubleshoot that later. I might have to... Oh, man, I can't even throw bits in my own channel to test it. Damn it. That's kind of against Twitch TOS. But welcome, everybody. I hope everybody's having a wonderful Sunday uh, afternoon right now. I think it's afternoon for virtually everybody, at least in the U.S. Uh, anybody outside the U.S.? Well, I hope you're having a good day or night or morning or something. Yeah, you, have to, you always have to re-sign into Streamlabs. The first thing I do is I refresh my Streamlabs page, and then it'll work just fine normally. <laughs> See, again, what is going on with that? That is so weird that that does that. I am super confused. Maybe that's something to do with my uh, my bot. I'm gonna I'm gonna nuke this guy. We'll turn him off. But anyway, let's uh, let's get into some gameplay. Streamlabs, Streamlabs can be pretty drunk in a gutter sometimes. Oh yeah, the fucking dude, your Ultima gameplay where apparently there's a a specific. I'm assuming there's a specific can. Like, is it is it named differently than all the other candles in the game? Uh, or is it like colored differently? Is it like that easy to lose? Cause that sucks. All right, game mode. What do we got? Family standard. Not sure what family means. Maybe it's just easier, I guess. Controller reverse on. Uh, that's probably up is down, down is up, which would be fine for me. Gamer attack O shot and plasma X. This is great. This this game is entirely is Japanese, but it's almost entirely in English, including the cutscenes. There's just Japanese subtitles, which makes it very easy for us simple Americans to play. Uh oh, there's a stage select right away. Oh, I can only I can only do the original one, so you probably gotta beat it. Uh the stage to be able to select it. So that's cool too. If anything's off, uh, video, audio, anything like that, just speak up in chat and let me know and I'll fix it. Back to a cutscene. I need to get hotkeys. Camera, Lieutenant? That's right. <laughs> wow! <laughs> that dude looked creepy as fuck! Okay, so... What do we gotta do here? Looks like we got a cursor. We can interact with the monitors, it seems like. Uh, can I talk to the people? Looks like I can talk to her. Let's talk to her. Oh, I forgot. For Japanese games, O is your interact button instead of X. You, you can call me Jack, Dr. Mukunoki. <laughs> you can call me Jack. Me, nice to meet you, Jack. The pleasure's all mine. He's trying to smolder a little too hard. I gotta do that one again, because we gotta see this. You can call me Jack. Oh, wait. It's a different scene. Have you ever had any shooting training? Yes, of course. I also have a Class A International Driver's License. <laughs> You're gonna need it. <laughs> God, I love this era of gaming. Oh, it's fantastic. Uh, that just makes me so happy. Fighters coming in. There are so many of them. Lisa, let's go. Okay. 
literally the casting call for this was can you kind of say English words on command? And that was the casting call. <laughs> Oh, I can't keep talking to her. Oh, that's too bad. Let's see what this dude has to say. Long time no see, Jack. Since your Navy days. Good to see you, Harry. It's nice to meet you, Dr. Mukunuki. I'm Harry. Harry Lindback. See, that guy's kind of cool. Like, he was, like, a little over the top, but at least he, 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 he was trying. Or not trying too hard. All right, what do we got here for options? Can I move around anything else? It looks like I can go down here and start game. So let's check out this map. Okay, this looks like the map of where we might be needing to go, obviously with the uh, little square box here. And that looks like Gamara. So let's, let's see what this has for us. Uh, I guess it's just an animation. How about this? Also an animation. All right. So that looks like a trash can that they put some symbols on because, <laughs> you know, these people in here need this huge trash can. All right. So this game is set up like Panzer Dragoon pretty much exactly. L and R supposedly rotate your camera around. Um, I think try or square is your Gamera shot and X. You tap it just to shoot. And I'm going to see if I can use the anal oh, analog controls are not supported. There we go. Yeah, Gamera works just like Panzer Dragoon. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. So I'm a big fan of this genre. I don't know if I'm kind of alone in that, but I just absolutely love rail shooters. I even have a big list on my spreadsheet of uh, a lot of games that I want to play that are literally just all the rail shooters that I can find uh, anywhere on any console. Obviously, I love Star Fox. Played through Star Fox 2 a while ago. I need to do it on stream, though. I need to do it on the harder mode because the default difficulty was holy shit easy. Hey, Marcy, what's going on? Yeah, we got some flying turtles up in here. I wonder if there's any time that is better to not lock on. Oh, wow. What the hell shooting me? Oh, that's right. I need to. I forgot. Does any of the other buttons do anything? Nice. Yeah, I need a... There's no map in this like there is in a... Pan, oh, wait, there is a map in this. It's just forward back. Okay, so this is pretty much Panzer Dragoon. I just need to be constantly spinning. All right, where are we at? Oh, behind us. I'm an idiot. I believe Gamera has like some sort of attack, special attack. I'm going to save it uh, just in case I need it, though. Good, there's one more. I wonder if I can avoid those things. Do I have any other movement abilities? Ooh, looks like we got a boss behind us. Oh, beside us. Probably want to take out the uh, missiles as they come in. Oh, damn it. Yeah, I probably need to shoot at those guys as they come in. Have a little uh, easier time. Alright, so we got the guns. I'm not sure what else I'm shooting. Oh, okay, we got more guns. Yeah, we need to make sure we take care of those so we can, uh... Shit, nope. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. There we go. Oh god, he's jumping over. 
Yeah, there's not as much movement in this as uh, Panzer Dragoon, I don't think. Unless I'm missing out on one of the mechanics here. But do I slow down? Do I need to slow down? I'm not sure if I can. Can I? Oh god, okay, I can't shoot those. Oh shit! A lot of missiles, or tentacles, something. It's Japanese, definitely tentacles. Oh god. Got them all. Yeah! We're in there. Stage clear. I forgot to take it off my cinematic scene. I'm not, I really do need like some sort of like keyboard command so I can just like swap between those two things quickly. Oh well. We're probably gonna get a cutscene now, so we'll just go ahead and leave it up. Oh, maybe not. Right in stage two. Nice. Man, Gamora is just a beast. Oh, shoot. I guess I needed to shoot those. I'm not sure if I even need to take out the ground targets. I probably do. Probably just for like points or something like that. I'm not sure if points are a thing in this game. Oh god, don't shoot that! Don't shoot... I wonder if you can take out, like, like civilian stuff like that, though. Yeah, the game, like, kind of amped up a little bit with the, uh, what you need to keep track of. It's totally fine. Okay, this is cool. Oh god, it's too many. Get him, Gamera. Not sure how many things uh, Gamera can attack at one time. If it's anything like Panzer Dragoon, it's like six or eight. Where are you at? Nice you. All right, we up. Uh, we we're on another boss again. Oh, it's up here. Shit. We want these guns down. Man, Gamera's just sitting there just tanking stuff. Not sure if, uh, I don't think Gamera has, uh, any sort of... I'm trying to press other buttons here. To see if there is, uh... Alright, I took out all the guns. I think it's pretty tanky. Thought Gamera had a special attack, but I guess I could be wrong here. Okay, we need to take out this guy for sure. There we go. We have some other guns over here, it looks like. Yep, those guys. Alright, got those. Beating the shit out of the ship. It's getting hard to find a weak spot now. Oh, here we go. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Just trying to shoot him. Trying to keep up. Oh, 
Oh god. This is actually more intense than it probably looks. Trying to find all that stuff and the flames that are coming- like the smoke is my biggest enemy here. I feel bad for this thing, it's so wounded. Can't even do anything anymore. We did it! I honestly think there is something like the energy gauge. I feel like that is something that I should be able to use. Oh, wait, that was just like a mid-boss. Shit. We're not done yet. I think that guy just suicided into me. This is definitely looking like a boss arena or something interesting. And nothing behind me. This thing's angry, whatever it is. I don't know what it is. I wish I knew more of the kaiju lore, whatever it's called. It's not really doing anything yet. Okay, I just said that and I think I have to actually shoot those out of the air. I can't target those. The music is kind of weird for a game like this. Oh god. Keep following it. You know, now that I have my component cables for my Saturn, I should play Bulk Slash again. That game was freaking cool. And it has multiple endings, multiple characters. And uh, Saturn definitely doesn't look that good on this video, by comparison, that's for sure. Alright, so we're almost dead. Hopefully that was the end of the stage. Stage clear. Gamera is happy. Giant flying turtle. What are we loading into? New stage? Ooh, cutscene. Look at that. That is... That is just... Goddamn majestic. Sausalito? The hell is Sausalito? Alright, so I did, um, since this is a Japanese game, I was worried about the controls, and I brought up something that mentioned the controls. Uh, I couldn't find a booklet, and any booklet I'd find would probably be in Japanese anyway. But, uh, let's see. There is, you have a wing meadow source. Indeed, nothing less than Gamera himself, who flies on your wing with support roll. By holding the fire button, you're targeting reticle shifts, and you can then lock onto multiple targets in a fashion identical to that of Panzer Dragoon games. When you release the button, your plane does nothing! Okay. Okay, I'm, uh, when you release blah blah blah, PD's homing with but certainly fun. Okay. I am not seeing anything in regards to controls that are different. Yeah, the controls are even more simple than Panzer Dragon, which is a little, was slightly disappointing, but it's all right. It's all right. But yeah, let's uh, let's check out what we got here for our wonderful cutscenes. We'll see what this guy does. Ooh. New report, Jack. The database is recovered in the rubble in Tokyo and Hawaii have been discovered to have used extraordinarily outdated language. That guy is French and trying not to be French at all. Hey, I guess camera sends something over there. Let's check it out. <laughs> oh, wonderful. 
Oh, we're going to get a ride on a bike. That'd be pretty damn cool. What do you got? BC 22. 3.4 meters uh, length, Y 1.3 meters, height 1.1 meter, 542 kilograms, pretty heavy, uh, 320 kilometers an hour, yeah, pretty fast, maybe like speeder fast, like if you're uh, Return of the Jedi. Unsi Goey, or, or wait, UNSA 601, God, I said Unsi Goey, are you serious? I'm a fucking idiot. So, not much else to see there, what do we got? Just that. What does Gamera got to say to us? Oh, he definitely sees something. Now, this is interesting. Among the little data remaining, they say they found codes similar to the ones written on the inscription found five years ago. Okay. So there's a little bit of mystery here. I thought we were going for DNA. Jack, you and Dr. Mukunoki, bring back Gauss DNA. <laughs> wow, okay. Just bring back Gauss DNA. I'll be mad. I know people with bosses like Lisa, that. I want you to ride the bike. I can handle it. Trust me. <laughs> All right. Anything more in here? Is it just, uh, no, nah, it just lets me do this. Well, any thoughts on the game so far? Seems all right to me. It's a little simple, but it's definitely, uh, enjoyable. I did think that the controls said that there was a special button that you could use. But, uh, I guess not. It's like it's gonna really get a little crazy with, uh, the looking everywhere aspect of the game. Seems like not all these guys are dangerous. Even though it looks like I need to definitely watch out for them, or I'm gonna take some unnecessary hits. It's kind of chill music. I'm down with that. Yeah, I definitely need to pay more attention to shooting this stuff out of the- oh boy. I'm- I'm screwed. Dang it. Yeah, I needed to pay more attention to shooting those out of the air. It's oh. Wow, I'm just getting murdered now. They definitely amped up the difficulty in this stage. already down to just one third of my life left we're probably not even like halfway to a mid boss yeah, I need to prioritize these guys when I see them yeah I think there was oh god I'm curious if I can just sort of let them pass me and they won't shoot me like this. Oh, thanks, Gamera. Opening the door for me. All right, so we passed that first part. I don't know if this game has any sort of uh, checkpoints or anything like that. Tastes like a tube. <laughs> it's a breakfast cereal. No. Man, if there was like Gamora breakfast cereals, like uh, Godzilla, Gamora, uh, shoot, like Mega Godzilla, all those crazy old monsters, like breakfast cereals based on that when I was a kid, I totally would have went for it. No problems at all. Would have went right for it. Oh, 
Oh man, wasn't fast enough, apparently. Alright, trying to get a little better at shooting the shots in the air, we're prioritizing doing that. Okay, music's kicking up. Kicking up a couple notches. That's that's good. Okay, you can see those bros powering up. We don't want them to shoot. I have a feeling those might be unavoidable considering they're slow. What is going on here? Oh god! Oh god! I don't know if this is a... Looks like I uh, need to slow down on my camera movements. I keep going too fast because it feels like I sh need to, but I'm not sure if I really do or not. Oh, shoot, that is something that can hit me. So far, we're doing really good on this boss. I do wish you had to, like, dodge left or right or had to do barrels or something like that. That would definitely make uh, the gameplay a little bit better in this. As a shooter, it's good. There we go. We did it. I think we did it. I'm not sure why it's not dead yet. The boss, the bar went down. Maybe it's a friend. Maybe I'll make friends with it. Ooh. Maybe I'll just be burying it. Well, that was kind of an easy mid boss. That was easier than the, the previous level. I'm assuming that was a mid boss. Wait, I didn't realize both of them are on this. Jack and, uh, shoot, whatever the girl's name is. Alright, I guess we're just cruising here. Oh, it was probably just loading. Way to disguise loading the next level. At least I don't have to shoot, like, little doors and stuff open like in Star Fox. I actually always kind of found that annoying. The speeder bike looks good. It uh, looks like uh, oh, I'm trying to think. Like cross between like Akira and Star Wars. Okay, this is probably going to be a boss. I don't know if shooting even does anything with this early on. I might just be wasting my time. I feel like this thing... Where are we at? There we go. I feel like the... The gun on the left is going to be important. Good. All right, good. We're killing everything as it comes out pretty quickly. Damn it. Focus on shooting those things more than the boss. Oh god. 
I think I'm ahead in damage versus my typical damage versus his damage. That's good. Oh, God. Shoot them all. Okay, I got a lot of them. We're still doing good. He hasn't changed up his mechanics much yet, so that's good. Okay, I can take a few of these. As long as I keep pumping out damage to him. So far, there's not been any phases or anything like that so far. And I say that. I don't know if that was avoidable or not. Didn't feel like it was. Oh god. Oh god. Getting down to the wire here. Shooting him right in the balls. So I was talking about phases. This is definitely a phase. Did it. Ooh, okay. That was a little close. Reach strats. <laughs> if it was reach strats, every single one of those balls would have hit me in the face at least every other time. That would have been a reach strat. Reed probably would have died here like 10 times too. It's not a phase, mom. Wait, I thought she was driving. I guess I had to get out. Maybe that was the DNA they needed to get. They had to, like, get out and uh, harvest it or something. But what is that? Oh, God. That's some two-headed behemoth. All right, I'm going to take a 30 second break here. I need to use the restroom. I will be right back. All right, I'm back. <laughs> yeah, longest, longest of breaks. All right, let's see what the uh, Wonderful's 90 Japanese FMV cutscenes have for us. I'm actually kind of excited for this. Ooh, something happened here. I guess that's Gamera maybe attacking the uh, two-headed sort of uh, winged creature that we just saw. We shall find out. That dude gets all the ladies. Jack, you and Dr. Mukunoki, bring back Gauss DNA. <laughs> he did it again. Mukunoki, Dr. Mukunoki. I guess she's Dr. Mukunoki. I'm done sending the data. Lisa, you stay here and wait for a call from headquarters. Roger. Wow. Apparently he doesn't think she can handle it. Jack, be careful. Man, that is that is a better love story than Twilight right there. Absolutely amazing. Ooh, do I get a new plane? That's all it does. That's some shitty four or five frame effect. Come on, man, this game is definitely a budget title. This is probably something that came out for like $20 in Japan back in the day. Look at that. Yeah. 
Oh, okay. So it's scary. Gamera's like, fuck you, I'm out. Like you guys can uh, you guys can deal with this on your own. Oh, here's the the bike in the background. What are you gonna do with it? Anything? Guess not. All right, so looks like we don't have anything else that we can uh, we can play with here. So let's go ahead and start the game. By the way, I have absolutely no idea how long this game is. Um, somebody actually wants to look that up. I'd be, I'd appreciate it. We're on stage five right now. Oh, okay. We're we're right in there on a boss fight. Apparently, that's fucking cool. Oh, look at that! Listen to that. Actually, that is so cool. This is actually fucking sweet! Why are there not more games like this? Ooh, that hurt. I'm not sure how I was supposed to avoid that. Get him, Gamera! Oh, okay, yeah, I see. Oh, okay, you can move. Just out, okay. Oh, I went right into it. Oh, I went into it again. Oh god, there's things everywhere! Oh, I need to prioritize those. I'm still winning the DPS war, but barely. Definitely need to watch out more often on the not only the lasers, but those balls. I'm not sure if regular shots or lock-ons. Uh, I don't think lock-ons are working on it. Okay. Taking off pretty good chunks of his damn or his health here. Oh, he's going down. You know, it's weird in this game, as you beat bosses, as you make them weaker, towards the end, they seem to get a lot less powerful outside of uh, the last boss we just fought. That one seemed like he got more powerful, like there was a new phase. But there was like that one big ship that uh, definitely got weaker. Yeah! I don't know what this dude's called, but we just shot both his heads off. That was a cool fight. That was a very cool fight. Uh, 1.5 hour. How many st do you, does it say how many stages there are? Because uh, I believe we are now on stage six. We've completely silenced Neo Galps. Lisa, what about the disc? I like how he just slowly turns his head, like trying to be uh, overly dramatic. And she's got those faces, man. They're just on point. Like trying to have like this sort of like commentary without actually saying any words yeah some big ship Gamera looks like it could just sit on it like that looks like that'd be a Gamera bar stool wait what Now Jack has to go save Lisa. And Gamera just seems very upset by this. Oh shit! We're going into space, dog. Get in there, Jack. Get in that space butthole. Oh wow, he missed a chance. Oh, no he didn't. He got into the space back door. <laughs> Gamera's like, fuck your portal. I'll just fly there. These guys are kind of uh, blending into the background a little bit. If 
physics cool. So far, that one level is uh, definitely the toughest out of all of them. Oh, I thought I killed him. I think I might actually need to like make sure I don't run into stuff on in this level. Maybe we'll see. So far, I haven't had to worry about it too much, but it's kind of looking that way. Got some environment ha environmental hazards. Oh, minus. Oh. Oh, these guys like just swinging around everywhere. Oh, that sucks. So basically just rotating around every once in a while seems to do wonders. Oh, just ran right into me. Boss time. Oh, we got tentacle monsters. Okay, so I need to maybe dodge here. Perhaps. I'm assuming these things are going to slam down on me and I'm going to need to move. Alright, so far not much. I don't know if I need to be paying attention to the other bro or not. Currently, I'm just kind of focusing on the one. Still could be doing better on health. Because I think this might be a mid-boss. Okay, we got one of them. Where's he at? Oh, front. Get him. Wait, is there two more? Yeah. Shit, I need to watch out. Oh god, I need to go. I need to avoid. Yeah. I'm having a hard time avoiding everything. A lot going on. God, oh god, this is getting close. I'm doing very little damage to them, it feels like. And they're doing tons to me. Time to try to clutch it. I got it. Yes. Woo. Okay. It's kind of cool. It still lets you target and shoot as it's dying. That's pretty, uh, pretty fantastic. Ooh, you got pizza. Oh, I want pizza. I had a pretty good lunch and I even uh, cooked uh, enough food for dinner as well. So I am kind of looking forward to that. But at the same time, pizza just sounds really good. A buddy of mine text messaged me uh, saying it was at, uh, Pizza West, which is a place that's like a, a really nice custom buffet pizza place that's near here, and it's pretty fantastic. Oh my god, okay, so I'm going immediately into another boss fight. Oh no, this is, this is gonna end poorly. I think I'm gonna lose definitely my first life. Whoa! That took off a good chunk of damage. Hopefully I get a start right there. Costco pizza. 
You know, I've heard Costco actually has a uh, pretty good pizza. Or just good food in general. All right, looks like I have to start over. Well, that kind of blows. It's like I'm just, oh wow, they keep just running into me. What kind of pizza is it? We're talking pepperoni, sausage, just plain cheese. Delicious. All right, so I think we're at the boss again. No, wait, no, never mind. Need to just try to mitigate as much damage as possible from these bros. And uh, the next time we fight the boss, we won't be so YOLO. We'll be way more defensive. Let's see if that. Oh, wow, that just wasn't cool. Oh, wow, come on. You'd really have to memorize a lot of stuff in this game to uh, get a no hit, because some of these things do different attacks, and some of them you have to prioritize before others, but since they don't look any different, you can't tell unless you just know it's coming. All right, so I'm not doing any better than last time, pretty much. Hopefully I can do better on the boss. I can't believe they have you do two bosses back to back. Did zero damage. Okay, we were doing this good last time. And then they started swinging at us. Oh. Okay, got those two, but there's two more apparently. And these are the ones that start swinging. These are the these are the bad boys. I do f feel like we took those other ones out a little easier. Ah, damn it. It looks like you need to go left every time. You actually need to go, uh, or opposite of that. Yeah, I somehow didn't get hit by that, even though it looks like I should have. <laughs> we'll take it. Okay, I just got hit by ceiling stuff. Okay, I missed that one. Good. Kill it. Oh, I turned into that one. Damn it. All right, so we do have more HP than last time. However, last time it looked like we uh, oh got a cheese one. Nice. Uh, Supreme is good as long as uh, Supreme doesn't have mushroom. Black olives I don't really like either, but at least they're easy to pick off. Mushrooms on the other hand can hide in there, and I'm not a huge fan. Like it won't absolutely ruin a pizza for me, but I will try to pick them off if I can.
All right, so this is another boss, but it's a bunch of enemies. So I think I have to prioritize every, all the things, basically. There's actually some input latency here, some slowdown. Oh God, I'm trying to dodge that stuff. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to dodge it all. Can't really see what they're doing. Ooh, that was pure luck. Absolutely pure luck. And pure luck again. And that was maybe a little less pure luck. Yeah, that was luck. Oh, damn it. Just one of those hits. Oh, no. Oh, why? Why, game? Why is there no checkpoints? Why do you give me two bosses back to back, which have really hard to avoid stuff? Yeah, mushrooms can be, if they're like super cooked, very like, very soft, and I don't get any kind of the mushroomy texture, I guess, uh, I'm not too bad with them. Alright, so again, need to try to minimize damage here. I say that, immediately get hit. And, god damn it. And, fuck. <laughs> I'm just getting hit by all the things. These, uh, seem like the guys that I'm fighting near the end. I do feel like I'm going to break my PlayStation controller. Oh, if I can only get through that. That would allow me to take another one of those red laser beam hits if I could just do no damage. I'm curious what that energy meter means. It looks like there's a second meter there, but I don't know what it means. All right, so there I tried something different. I actually just tried to avoid shots from stuff that was coming from the background, and that worked. Oh, God. Just basically swerve up and down and hope that you can avoid stuff. It's kind of what I'm going for here. There is a method to this madness. Just trying it out. Ah, oh, damn it. I even saw that coming. I couldn't do anything about it. All right, these guys I don't have to worry about. All right, so we're back on the boss again. Let's, uh... Well, I am curious if there is, like, some special bomb or maneuver that I'm not doing right. Wouldn't that be a real kick in the dick if I'm supposed to be doing something else? Seriously, that would be, like, the worst if I actually had these bombs that would make these fights, like, way easier. And I'm totally screwing the pooch. It's very possible. Because I can't really look up much on this game since, well, it's Japanese. And the only thing written in English doesn't mention anything about it. Damn it, I took a hit. If I can get out of this with half HP, I might be able to beat that other fight. If I get a little luck. And I took a hit, random fucking hit there. Damn it. 
Normally I wouldn't be mad about taking a hit, but this is just seems unreasonable. God damn it! <laughs> And I did, God damn it! I'm just you can't avoid that. And mm, mm, mm. and it, and he swung down on me, and I just got hit by things in the back. Ah. Uh. Wow. So fucked. Don't break your controller. I'm going to try not to, but... Okay, so I can basically take one hit in this next fight. This... The, the, the seal, I'm wondering if I'm getting near the end of the game, because... There is no reason for them to do this. Without that. Come on, lock on. We're the bigger bros. I wonder if there's some kind of pattern I need to, like, know how to, like, do. <laughs> the lock on stops your shots and if you press it for even a millisecond you start the lock on and i didn't kill the last of the three ball set there <sighs> i too had the national american food adopted from italy <laughs> was it really adopted from italy a lot of times, uh, at least in America, we think like, oh, this came from here. And a lot of times it didn't actually come from there. Uh, anyway, I need to use the restroom again. So I'll be right back in about 30 seconds. Oh, shoot. I accidentally pressed start as I sat down, but that's okay. I'm ready to go. Played Cards Against Humanity last night. <laughs> I cover myself in tomato sauce and cheese because I am pizza. Wait, what kind of defines an Italian guy? Because Italian guys kind of look like French guys, kind of look like Irish guys, at least in my experience. Of course, I don't know that many Italians, so maybe it's just limited exposure. Anyway, let's try this unfair bullshit again. I'm going to claim that, and it's nothing to do with me needing to get good. Damn. 
Wait, what is that? Gamera just did something. I saw a... I saw a meter come up. I hit O and I saw a meter come up. Damn it! The camera changes where you can't get over there fast enough. Alright, so I might be not... Oh, I saw that coming. I still got hit. Wow, we're doing worse than normal. Can we, can we, can we restart? Can't restart. Dodge that one. Saw that one coming. Basically, if I see yellow, I need to just like just bail and go straight up. Okay, so we started out horribly, came back. Okay, so there was a meter that looked like uh, Gamora could do something. I didn't mean to do that. We're going to try it here. Oh! Oh, you can do that? I'm not sure what that's doing. Oh, I'm spinning him up. I don't know what that's doing, but it's doing a lot of damage. Oh, it puts him on cooldown. Okay. Fair enough. I might have to save that for this section now that I know that. It seems like there's just damage here at the end you can't avoid. Oh, no, I ran into that too. Alright, so... I think we can charge up Gamera here. And maybe do something with these guys. So, if you hold down O, you can't use your lock on. But you can use your shots. We're going to charge up Gamera for the start of this boss fight. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I need to watch out for that. Oh, God, I got hit by it twice. Okay, that didn't do much of anything. All it did was kind of distract me. Oh, and I down. Oh, I dove right into it. Oh, I'm still alive. Oh, hey. Look at that. I'm really good at games. I really thought that was just going to one shot me, so I was like, I was already in give up, give up mode. Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't even know. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, I went up into it. Oh god. But what it just keep if I think if I just keep going low there, the red beams can't hit me. 
So it looked like the charged up Gamora did some damage on the tentacle dudes, but didn't do much damage against those guys. However, it does look like it's something that, uh... All right, we'll see how useful it is. These guys I'm trying to avoid. So Gamora kind of acts like a really powerful homing thing that can do all the damage from all around. Okay, so I, I did take less damage there. So that's cool. As long as I can get that charged up early, then it's not too bad. Okay, gonna, oh nice, did it, did it that time. There should be one over here that's gonna dive at me or charge something soon and be on the right hand side, I believe. Are you kidding me? That guy. Ah, oh, didn't, I knew it, and I missed it. All right, I think we did a sliver better. All right, we're going to charge Gamera up for our bros here. Okay, slice and dice those bros pretty good. Oh, I turned into it again. Uh, turn into it. No. Oh, God. All right before I was about to take damage. Okay, so we did good there. We did good. All right, so we're going to fully charge Gamera and see what he can do right away uh, off the bat with these bros. Probably not a whole lot, but once he's done, I can go back to locking on, which would be totally fine. Actually, we're going to see what he does with this. Anything? I have a feeling he's not going to be very good in that form against these guys, so... So anytime I see a red beam, I'm going to go low. That's the plan. And I immediately didn't go low.
Did I get one of them? I think I got one. Low, 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 low. Low. We're gonna, while we're doing this, we're gonna charge up Gamera. Yeah, take that, bro. Shoot those things. Nice. Okay, they're near. God dang. Not getting in hardly any damage. Okay, got another one. Where's the last? Oh my god, he's just flying around me. Get away from me. No, 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 no. Where's he at? yet oh are you kidding me oh it kept flying off the screen man god he kept flying off the screen and then he did those things at an angle in which i couldn't really shoot them all in a row very easy and i just died damn it all right well, at least we kind of figured out how to use a uh, I thought there had to be something else to this game. So it looks like probably on that last guy, it would be good to charge up Gamera and just let him go ham on that last dude. And, uh, yeah. We're, we're getting our strategy set here. Wait, what? I thought I killed those guys. Ah, damn it. Man, every single pixel of health matters in this. Jesus Christ. This went from being like like super easy, I thought I was gonna finish this in like no time whatsoever, to holy shit, everything just hurts. And I knew that was coming and I fucked it up. I'm in like super tryhard mode too. Oh God, yes, we did it. Shit. Yeah, duck that one. I knew that was coming, ducked it. I think we're getting near, yep, all right. Those guys are just bonus. Let's go. Well, that was a total waste. Jesus Christ.
Oh, what? took damage from something, I'm not sure what. And I just took damage again. Uh, we're already at the HP that we finished this fight with last time. And just took damage from whatever the ceiling was. Lucky there. All right. We are not in a good health position. Not even remotely. Alright, so this time we're not going to shoot Gamera early. We'll wait until the bros actually show up and I'm firing at them. Shit. That did do a lot more damage than last time though, so that's good. Duck, duck, stay ducked. Okay, so staying duck doesn't work on those guys, and neither does blood. Uh, those beams didn't do so much damage, it'd be fine. I did fuck up on that, though. I had a, fig I had a feeling it was going to be tracking me up there. I should have just went down. I need, to, I need to, like, go up for a little bit, then down for a little bit. But I need to make sure that I don't go down into the beam. That's the main problem. God damn it! Let's go. Okay, hey, knew that was coming. There's gonna be another one of those soonish. Those are the dive bombers. We're gonna have more dive bombers right there. Good. 
It's gonna be a, a laser dude on the left, I think. There he is. Nice. We had Gamera ready for him that time. Oh, uh, dive bomber. That's right. We did we did a lot better that time. Took barely any H or damage comparison compared to what we did before. All right, so we're gonna let these guys. Oh, so it seems like... Well, that seemed like a total waste. The one with the blue eyeball seems to shoot uh, energy shots, so I need to watch out for those like that. We did good, we did good. Okay, miss, they missed the shots. Nice, we didn't take any damage whatsoever. Turn into it. Now we just need to play these other guys correctly. Like, we did that first time. That was actually really good. When I went in there with the uh, Gamora strat that I fucked up in the beginning, but I played them better. Hopefully this time I play these guys correctly. And don't end up accidentally running into red beams. I think the first time I just got lucky with the red beams. And I killed that one guy, like, super early, too. Oh, no, 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 I didn't mean to do that. Ah, oh, fuck. Fuck it. Beam? Beam? Beams? No. Mm -hmm. Beam? I just want to see it coming. If I can see it coming, I can dodge it. There we go. We're doing good. Did not see that coming. Got lucky. Still got lucky again. But we're okay with that. Oh, God. Oh, I didn't see those. We're going to charge up Gamera here. We're just going to stay back here and try to dodge shit. We're going to let Gamera do some damage. Shit. We're in the beam phase again. Down to one. Oh god, he did the beam and the shots at the same time. Holy shit. Hadn't seen that before. Okay, we killed the shots. Nice. Nice. 
Dodge, dodge. Let him go. He knows he, he knows he's about to die. Fucking did it. Oh, God damn. Woo. My heart is pumping on that one. Holy shit. Nailed it. God, it feels good. Ah, you know, for as simple as game as this is, that required a decent amount of strategy. Enemy fortress target identified. I'm commencing the operation. Jack, it's you. Where the hell you been all day? Where the hell you been all day, Jack? I swear I'm not French. Yeah, sir, look at this data. Oh, that's what I was afraid of. <laughs> <laughs> the guy in his fake teeth. What's going on? Ooh, what is this? Ooh, I wonder if this is going to be our uh, our final boss. What do we got going on here? We're going to see what's on our viewfinder. Jack, I figured out the data I received from Lisa, an ancient ruler who'd been sealed in another space and time, has been found missing again. Okay, so maybe we'll find Lisa. You know, I think they just used the words DNA and just thought like, yeah, that sounds cool. We'll use those words. Yeah, he does. Oh, what is this? Somebody fancies himself a uh, director. Oh, she's like in an embryo or something. Help me, Jack. All right. Anything else over here? Boy, they could have just made this cur- Oh, hey. Nice. That's all we get. I'm not sure what that is. That's supposed to be fire, a sign, something. Kind of a weird thing to have animated. You'd think they'd just have it animated because it looks cool. Same with this. Uh, underwater speed, 180 knots. Nice. Mach 3.5, really? Holy shit. Classification unknown. Huh. I don't know what that means in the, the whole kaiju thing. Yeah, right? Japanese game, anything goes. All right, so it doesn't look like we have anything else we can look at. So I think this is going to be stage seven, and hopefully it's nothing like stage six was, because god damn, that was, that was rough. They uh, definitely decided to eat your quarters in that particular stage, or uh, that's where you had to stop the rental. <laughs> Luckily, we it did force us to press more buttons and learn about the Gamora attack, which was kind of handy if you know what's coming and you have it charged up. It seems pretty pretty nice. Dragon Fortress. Ooh. Back in his natural habitat. Oh, is this a boss? But I don't seem to have lock-on ability right now. I have a feeling this thing's gonna shoot all kinds of crap at me. Okay, so I can't use Gamora's ability, it seems. Oh god, I can't avoid those! Okay. So his attacks are like really far away. So if I need to kill those missiles, that's bad.
There gonna be more over here? Oh no, okay. I must have killed the other guns. Nice. Oh, I'm so fucked. Oh, I somehow did it. Oh, I'm so fucked here. It, can I shoot those? I can't shoot those. Okay, so I need to be firing missiles at those while I'm shooting these with my lasers, is what it looks like. It's kind of an interesting mechanic. I like that. It's actually a good way to do a boss like this. Nice, I like that. That was a good fight. Hopefully that wasn't the end. I'm assuming it's not going to be the end. Yeah, here we go. Not even my final form. Yo! We got Big Bird in here. The music is so weird, but I like it. Is there anything over here too? Yeah, there is. I want to kill these hand things first. I feel like they're going to cause me way more problems than anything else. Oh shoot, I need to watch out for that. Oh, and those guys. Okay, I think I killed that one guy. I thought I did, maybe not. Oh god, I, I'm doing horrible now. Oh boy, I need to watch out for that. That's going to do a lot of damage. Looks like I need to dodge left when that thing's up. Damn it. I have a feeling it's going to start shooting like literally everything at me. Yes. Okay, that's probably not it, though. I'm going to wager that is not it. That was way too easy. You going to fall over? Not that falling over means much of anything. Yeah, almost next phase. There's definitely going to be a phase three. Yep, here we go. Oh, God. What? Oh, boy. Yeah, I need to make sure I don't... Uh, yeah, fly through these. I gotta fly through these correctly, I think. Yeah. Oh, boy, I need to shoot those. I didn't see those coming at me. Okay, what is that? What is that? Okay, fly through the center. What the fuck? Oh, thanks for the fall. Oh, God. Oh, no, God. I do <laughs> No! Oh, I looked at the follow. Why did I do that? Oh, but thank you, Vilio. <laughs> I appreciate it. Oh, damn it. Fuck, yes. F in chat. Well, at least we know there's at least three phases. 
Uh, I know what the uh, the phases are going to be throwing at me, and hopefully I can avoid those a little bit better. And uh, yeah, I have a feeling this is a final boss, so hopefully we get him down, because I'm getting kind of hungry. I wouldn't mind, uh, wouldn't mind eating. We shall see. This game doesn't have saves, it seems like. If it does, then it's an autosave. All right. So this first boss, we really just got to make sure we do everything perfect and lose no HP. And the second boss, we just need to minimize damage. We need to take out these guns a little faster than we did last time, too. Nice, we're doing way better this time on, on that stuff. Man, the music is just so weird for a boss fight, you know? Okay, we know how to avoid those now. Just get rid of these guys early. Nice, we didn't even take a hit. No damage. Alright, so this one I need to definitely focus on not taking any of the damage. Or minimize as much damage. Man, that music's just so weird and cool. I love it. Damn it. I'm doing really bad against those things. I keep getting hit by them. There we go. Why am I having a hard time locking on? Man, it's like a lag just got way worse for some reason. Shit. Need to avoid that. Oh, that did so much damage to me. Fuck. Oh, man. Okay, so last time I got lucky and avoided those. Uh, accidentally. Man, it's so hard to catch the last one of those. Hey, what is it? Okay, stay left. Stay left. Stay left. S stay left, I guess. No, that's right. Those things just, you can't avoid those. You have to shoot them out of the air. I'm doing piss poor. Such a good phase one. Oh, uh, okay. I don't know if I got immune there or what. All right, so maybe we can uh, get, goal here is probably not to win. But maybe I can get far enough in to see if he's got any tricks up his sleeves uh, near the end. Incoming bad storm. Oh, yeah. Oh, is your internet like that where it gets a little bit, a uh, little bit, a little bit soggy, and everything goes to hell? Wow, I don't even know how to avoid that. Oh, 
Oh! Man, those are... Need to remember to keep the damage up. Okay, there's gonna be those things. Oh no! I got hit by the... Mm, I was so worried about the little yellow things coming during the second rings that I end up... Those rings do so much damage to you. I need to make sure I don't get hit by those. Tornado warning. Oh. Well, hell. Wait, what area do you live in? Because I live in, a uh, well, Tornado Alley. Alright, let's see if we can get a, uh, perfect phase one again. Oh shit. Well, not a perfect phase one, but minimal amount of damage is fine. North Carolina, right on. Yeah, I'm in Kansas City, so as you can imagine, we uh, we get our fair share of tornadoes here as well, so I think that shit seriously. And I wish I could use Gamera's attack. Maybe I should just focus on the center here. Get these things as they come. Oh, God. God damn. Shit. Left. 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 Right. Lots of these trying to kill me. Left or right, I mean. Okay, that was better. That was better. I think we're in there with more HP than we have had. I was still not good though. Man, trying to take out those uh, blue triangle things, the the lag starts catching up and it actually uh, affects your latency uh, of your controller. And so trying to get your crosshair over to them is much harder. You kind of like lose your cadence, basically.
Damn it, those things just follow you. I don't even know how to avoid that. Just don't get hit by that. Oh, don't get hit by these either. Right down the center. Don't get hit by that. Just don't get hit by these. That was good. Oh god, that was not good. And layering the attacks like that, not cool, dude. Oh, I did not start off very good there. No, 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 no. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't hear these. God damn it. He makes you swing your camera down and then shoots like, uh, looks like he's got kind of a random pattern. And he's got combos there where it's going to be very hard. Like... If I hear the boing, 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 I need to be looking up as soon as possible. Shit. Well, I'm going to pause it real quick and use the restroom, and then we're going to try again. And uh, we're getting closer, getting closer, chipping them down. I do wish you could use Gamera's attack. I don't know why they would take that away. It's weird, but... All right, I'm back. Damn, my arms hurt me a little bit. Got to mash on these buttons. All right, wish me luck. Want a perfect phase one and a much better phase two. That's what we're shooting for. And then phase three will play out how it plays out. This phase gets much easier as you kill these guns. That's kind of nice. Or missile launchers, I guess is what they are. You know, I never realized your lock-on actually stays locked on. I can keep firing and wait for good lock-on opportunities. All right, come on. Did that hit me? Alright. I think that was perfect. I didn't... I don't look like it took damage, so... Alright. Let's 
guy is kind of a bullet sponge. I've been going more for his chest. It looks like he takes more damage if you hit him in the blue spots with the lasers. So that's kind of what I've been going for. Um, I think I need to shoot these guys to close their little hand things, maybe. Maybe that will work better. See, I missed right there. I shouldn't have missed, but I totally did. See, I keep missing those. And I have I just basically just have to eat the hit. See? This is so hard. See there I got lucky and I, I, I hit one of them as it came out. Left or right? Oh, I can dodge him. Oh, nice. I didn't know I could dodge him. So I can kind of bait him over here and then go whoop. Nice. We learned. So bait him. Go this way. Nice. Bait it. Go. Bait it. Go. Oh, that one, that one I could have done better. Oh, no. Okay, we did way better, way better. And I can do better, too. Like, next time, now that I know to be able to dodge those things, fuck yeah. Gonna head out, find something. Okay. Later, Vilio. Uh, Vilio. Welcome to the stream. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Hopefully we beat this bitch. If not this time, soon. Waiting for the... Those guys. I don't think I can avoid... Oh, I can. Because I totally just did. Take as much advantage of this as possible. Not take any dumb hit. Okay, we can... We can stop a lot of these. Maybe not all. Oh no, I screwed up! Oh, but I- Oh, I didn't have to pay for it. Nice. Okay. Down the center. Did I kill him? I killed him! Ew. Oh, I was so focused I wasn't even paying attention to the health bar, nothing. I was just paying attention to dodging all the things. I was goddamn Neo, I was in the Matrix, I dodged all of the bullets. Oh god, he's gonna- phase 4 incoming? No? No, you better not! 
Oh, this is... Oh, wait, what? He gave up the ghost. Get him, Gamera! Get him! Yeah! You look fucking weird! But you... Oh, wow. That's... That can't be healthy. You might need to go to the doctor for that. Got him! We had to blow up, like, an entire island. Uh, but that's okay. We'll get the, uh... Lisa, the, the Japanese doctor, back. Because, you know... We can sacrifice a few hundred thousand lives for, for her. <laughs> it burns when he PVPs. Seriously, Nima, come on. Oh, I thought that was Godzilla for a second. He does look a lot like Godzilla in the face. Do we have another stage? Oh, Neo Hong Kong? Uh, might be. It did say Neo Hong Kong earlier when we were in the city, which we might still be- oh, Last battle! Fuck! I don't know why this thing doesn't have a health bar. That is, uh... Disconcerting! I can charge up Gamera for this, though. I think this is just a survive everything phase. Wow, why did how did that hit me? And my controls are so slow right now. Okay, so actually targeting that with G these with Gamera, not the best idea. I think just shooting them is a better idea. Yeah, get in there! Get in there! Do that damage! This is... This is some independence level day bullshit. I don't know if I killed it. It's looking pretty close to dead. And it doesn't have a health gauge. I can't target anything. It looks like, looking like it's dying. I'm not sure it's coming out after... Anything's coming out after that. Fuck yeah, flying disc down. Stage clear. Okay, so that said, that was literally titled Final Stage, or Final Boss. So I guess we are... We might be done with Gamora 2000.
Okay, so in that giant ball of flame, she somehow fell to the ground and survived. And is on land, not 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 in water at all. <laughs> well, she kind of was in that little uh, cocoon-looking thing there, so there is that. Aha, so she was in that. Lisa, are you alright? Yeah. Please tell me they kiss. They have absolutely zero chemistry, but I would love it. Oh, Gamera's. Is that a happy dance? I think that's a happy dance. He's like, I just slayed bitches. Yeah, I think they're just throwing together English words that they think sound cool. Sort of like a lot of titles from the 90s that were uh, had Japanese like subtitles. There were a bunch of English words that didn't make sense, but they sounded cool when thrown together. Like super fan fiction bullshit, but even worse. But it was charming, though. All operations complete. Dr. Mukinoki and I are on our way There's a PC Engine course. game called All Dines that had a, uh, a subtitle. I can't remember what it was named now, but it was like the craziest fucking thing ever. Wow. They love each other. You gotta have all the babbies. I'll shoot you with my medulla oblongata. Ah, it's so uplifting. All clear. That was a pretty, for what that was, that's a pretty good game. I wish I would have known about the Gamera mechanic before stage fucking six out of eight. Uh, but that was worth it. That was really good. Very button mashy. Definitely a rail shooter. Definitely a budget rail shooter. Uh, licensed title. So it had a lot of things going against it, but it still prevailed. That was a good title. The realistic graphics. Hey. This is back when they actually used to like film people for cutscenes and it looked awful. I can't even think of a, a recent game that uses actual live actors and footage like that outside of uh, there's one FMV game called I think Her Story that's on Steam and probably a few other platforms. Uh, it won like a couple of awards too because apparently it's really good but that's the only one I can think of that actually has like uh, real footage of real people everything else is like in-game cutscenes or uh, CGI mostly in-game these days which is good because going forward in the future when things get remastered it won't look awful or the cutscenes won't look awful a lot of stuff from the PS2 early 360 and PS3 era look pretty terrible everything's very compressed in the video department well, we'll let the we'll let the credits play out here, and uh, let's see, Nima. I think you said it would take an hour and thirty-five. I want to say for a full playthrough, or an hour and twenty-five, something like that, which seems about right. If I would, know, if I actually like, if I played through this game again, it'd probably take about that long, maybe a little bit less. But that was uh, since the start of the stream, and I think it took me about ten minutes to get into game or more. Uh, it's been two hours and seventeen minutes, so not bad, not bad on the clear. It definitely could have been a lot worse. Stage six, uh, that back-to-back -back bosses, that was definitely the hardest thing to do, at least until I understood the mechanics. Super seducer. <laughs> I don't know if super seducer really counts, Nima. God, part of me wants to play another game, but I'm also getting a little hungry, too. And I do want to do some other stuff tonight. Maybe I'll come back and stream later. For some reason, I'm in the, kind of a platforming mood. Maybe I can go back to that Lomax game, start out on stage four and kind of like figure it out. I wouldn't mind beating that game because as much as I was hating on it, it's got its charm. And being a Lemming spinoff is just kind of kind of neat. This game has such weird music. It's like they hired somebody that like kind of knew what they were doing out of college and probably went on to be really, really good to do, to do the music for this game. That's my theory anyway.
kept everything on the cinematic scene there for like the last part of the game since we are in very intense territory. That and I also kind of forgot to switch it. Technically the way I was supposed to do it is like this is your main gameplay stuff and anything that's like uh, cutscenes I swap over but I'm pretty bad at it. I need like this giant button that I just mash like right in front of me to swap scenes. Then I might remember to do it. Oh, even the credits are short. What if it locks unlocks anything? I didn't. I doubt it since they're. Uh, I don't think this thing has any kind of saves or anything like that. Mission complete. Save end. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so you only get uh, an option to save once you complete it. So continue game, new game, option. I bet you I got the stage select now. I don't know what family is. I am curious what that game mode is. And then what uh, difficulties we have. Easy, normal, expert. Okay, expert's going to probably be insane. I think one of the hardest things about that game wasn't really the gameplay. It was the fact that there was a lack of ways to fluidly dodge stuff like uh, you know Star Fox has like the barrel roll uh, Panzer Dragoon you can like move around the screen a little faster uh, the main issue in this game was the lag like once you got lagging that it directly affected how quickly you could move and your crosshair would move and uh, yeah that made it kind of interesting nice Neo Tokyo or Neo Hong Kong god I keep saying Neo Tokyo because there's that one uh, awesome song called Neo Tokyo Oh, I could replay it in Japanese. That'd be kind of that'd be kind of fantastic. Family mode is when you shoot the answer to elementary math problems. If you get it wrong once, you die. Wow, that's a that's a pretty harsh uh, that's a pretty harsh family mode. I'm assuming it's gonna be something along the lines of anybody can play through it without dying, pretty much, or it's almost impossible to die. It's like easy, but you know. Oh, part of me wants to try it. Let's try it real quick. Let's see what happens with family mode. I also put it on Japanese because weeb. I wonder if uh, her lines are going to be dubbed as well. Definitely dubbed. <laughs> the wannabe smoldering look. All right, so we're gonna see we're gonna see what this this whole family thing's about, and then after that, we're probably gonna kick it on over to somebody else, and I'm gonna go get some food. It'd be pretty badass if, like, it just had permanent Gamora mode where he's just slinging around the place like this, like, Frisbee of Death. That'd be pretty fantastic. What is that? I can't lock on. Weird. I don't know what this is. I can't tell if it's any easier or harder because this game started out like balls, balls easy. So I did a... Uh Yeah, I can't lock on to anything. Maybe family mode is harder. I'm just blowing up everything. Don't worry, everybody. I'm here to save you. Just stop. Stop what you're doing and let me save you.
Okay, so maybe this is just simplified mode where you don't even get lock-ons or anything. I am curious. We'll, we'll finish this first boss here. We'll see what happens. Seriously, what is this? Like, why is that up there? I don't get it. So I can take damage. Yeah, this is, uh, just weird. I had already killed this guy last time before he got to here, I think. Boy, my kingdom for uh, auto fire. This is like super boring. Definitely gonna finish this guy and uh, yeah, we'll be done with uh, Gamora 2000. Yeah, we never even got this close. Like, we, he never got to fire those missiles the first time I played this. So family mode is uh, the Dark Souls of Gamora 2000? Is that what... Is that what this is? Oh god. I, just, I might just like say fuck these missiles, let him hit me, and just kill this guy. Oh wow. He just decided to up and die, even though his, uh, his health gauge was still up quite a little bit. So much slowdown. Stage clear. All right, so family mode, definitely kind of a disappointment. So what we're going to do is we're going to pause it right there. Let me check something real quick. And um, see about what we can do about uh, getting me some food. Oh, Shikan the Forever Man. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Anybody else? Do, 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 do. Looking for somebody to host. Not really seeing anybody. Let's see here. Uno momento, por favor. All right, we're going to go ahead and host Sharpie. We'll call it good. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and start up some music here. Everybody, thank you very much for coming out. It was a good time. Gamora 2000 was actually a fairly decent game. I was pretty happy with it. Uh, for a budget title in Japanese, a lot of fun for this afternoon. So anyway, I hope everybody else enjoyed that. And I hope all of you have a very good day. Take care. 
and bye.